Vancouver realtor has found himself on the brink of a legal battle with DC Comics, home of Superman. The company is threatening to sue him over the use of the iconic logo. But as CTV Scott Hurst reports, the so-called real estate superhero hopes to avoid an epic showdown. You can't find many phone booths anymore, but it doesn't take much for realtor Ian Brett to transform. We felt Vancouver needed one, right? I need to stand up and be a real superhero. Meet Captain Vancouver, his super alter ego. But one very important person is upset. Superman himself. I'm not a man of steel, I'm a man of sales. Brett trademarked Captain Vancouver in 2013 with no issues. Recently, he tried to trademark the phrase real estate superhero too. That proved to be his kryptonite. Lawyers have ordered him to stop. A lawyer in Toronto said, no, we can't use it. And they sent us a letter, bit of a threat actually, <laughs> telling us we have to stop it because they own all trademarks of the word superhero in. The similarities in the logo and iconic pose are also part of the legal tug of war. I don't think I look like him. I definitely don't have the muscles he has. If I took my glasses off, I wouldn't even be able to see, so not like seeing through walls and stuff, right? I'm not like him in any way. I don't think the original Captain Vancouver ever could have thought someone would have to navigate such an issue. Regardless, we contacted the Toronto law firm working on behalf of DC Comics. It had no comment. Sail ahoy! A good superhero also knows when not to be a villain. Nobody wants lawsuits, right? But I just want to see the, the funny side of this. So Brad has decided to tweak his logo and he hopes to find a peaceful resolution. Scott Hurst, CTV News, Vancouver.